Hello guys, welcome to your favorite math tutorial channel. This is your math exam coach. Uh, today we have uh, a question that requires us to just solve without a calculator. And we are going to see how uh, we can evaluate uh, this expression without using a calculator. Uh, but before we jump into that, uh, if you are new to this channel, welcome. Just make sure you, you like, make sure you subscribe, and make sure you share with others as well. If you are a returning viewer, I'm glad you're back. Uh, make sure you like and also share this content with others. Alright, so let's dive into the question. Alright, so we're given uh, this expression, so it's 1 over square root of 1 plus square root of 2, uh, we can see the consistency here in terms of the progression of the, the denominators up we get until we get to the square root of, of 100. Okay, so how to, what can we do here? So we have to do some rationalization. where we want to make sure that the denominator is a rational number. So, for example, if we take the first expression, which is just 1 over square root of 1 plus square root of 2, uh, if we want to rationalize this, we need to multiply the numerator and the denominator by square root of 1 minus square root of 2 over root 1 minus root 2, like this. And when we do this, what do we get? Um, so this is the 1 minus root 2 will be the numerator, then therefore square root of 1 plus square root of 2 multiplied by square root of 1 minus square root of 2. So we can simply expand this. Uh, this is root 1 minus root 2 over. So root 1 times root 1. This is 1. Root 1. Root 1 times, uh, times root 2. Uh, so this becomes minus root 1. 2 uh, plus root 1 root 2 minus 2. So this can, uh, we can simplify this as root 1 minus root 2 over, so this will cancel out minus and plus, so this becomes 1 minus 2. So this becomes um, minus minus 1, which we can simplify to uh, here. Square root of 1 is 1, so this becomes uh, negative 1 plus root 2. That's how we, we simplify that. But we, we, notice, we, we notice something here we can extend the same thing to all the other expressions here. Uh, so what do we, how do we do that? So let's do it. So we can rewrite this equation as 1 over root 1 plus root 2. Then we're going to do the rationalization, which I'm going to show in red here root 1 minus root 2 over root 1 minus root 2 uh, plus we're going to continue that on all the expressions up until we get to 1 over root 99 plus root 100 times we're going to rationalize this by root 99 minus root 100 
over root 99 minus root 100. All right, so as we, we saw above, this becomes negative 1 plus root 2. If we go to the second expression here, uh, this becomes plus with minus root 2 plus root 3, and we continue until we get to negative root 99 plus root 100. Right, okay, so we simplified the first one is minus 1 plus root 2 minus root 2 plus root 3 and we continue until we get to minus root 99 plus root 100. And as you can see here, this cancels with this one, so this continues all the, uh, all the way where these numbers are cancelling each other. And so what we then end up with we're going to end up with the first term, which is negative 1, plus root 100, which is the same as 10. So we have negative 1 plus 10. Therefore, our answer is 9. All right, so that's how we would solve uh, this uh, simple question. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, uh, make sure you like, make sure you share with others, and if you are new to this channel, make sure that you subscribe. Until next time, goodbye for now.